all right wonderful people i want us to pay attention to this video that we are watching right now i want us to pay very big attentively you will understand everything that is playing in this video now watch Kadnarinze. what this man will do to him he pushed his face away by the way the man that you are seeing on this wheelchair is pope francis of vatican city in rome you know when we are telling our people all these things that is happening they don't seem to understand i keep on repeating the video so that you can be able to caption what i want you to see regardless that this man is on wish here, and i want you to see the humiliation and discrimination on this video now pay attention francis shake the first man the second also cardinal kiss him on his two cheek as he's kissing him francis was pimping who is the next he's a black man now see what he will do he push his face away now do you begin to understand that you are nobody to these people they are seeing us as in the royal i don't want to say this in english so that it's, it's not going to you know go against their community standard but I want you to see what is playing. Our people are still there defending these people. Defending the religion that they don't know how it come about. The religion that they forced on you. They massacred our people for you to believe in this religion. At the same time, they are still humiliating you people. Pay attention and see what is going to happen now. I want you to pay very... Look at it. He move his face because Pope Francis, in his mind, he's thinking that probably this Cardinalense is going to kiss his cheek and is forbidden for a dark man like me to kiss them. And up to date, our people are still following this religion that they force on them. They massacre our, their people. They kill a lot of our people. For us to believe in this religion, we are going back to our root. As we just finished watching this video, I hope every one of you understand what is played, what played on this video. It's obvious. But I know that some of our people are senseless. They have a lot of gullible people in our land that they can't even understand the root of their problem. But we are here to correct it. We are here to point out the root of your problem so that you can be able to solve it. You see this religion is number one of our problem. They use it to bacchanize our mind. They use it to make us, you know, lesser a human. They use this thing to get us not to react when we're supposed to react. That is the reason why today the full are killing, maiming our people, destroying souls and properties of our people every single day. But they will tell you to go and pray. Keep on praying. And those people that, that, that brought you that religion, at the same time, who letting you give discrimination every single time. Cardinalians, I don't want to go to the issue who's supposed to be the Pope. I don't want to go to the issue. You know, this Pope, they always vote for someone to become a Pope. Do you know that Canarese was among those people that they're supposed to be, he's supposed to be the person that's supposed to be there, but they won't give it to him. Who are you to lead them? Who are you as a black man to lead these people? It's impossible. This one now, you are seeing it koro koro. Except you lack ability to reason. That is when you begin to defend stupidity. But because our people like to defend stupidity. You see it playing. They are now telling you you are nobody. We are going to go back to our road. But let me introduce myself before I will go further. All right, wonderful people. Freedom fighters, lovers of freedom, great people all over the world. You are welcome once again on IPOB Rapture Media under the leadership of Mazin Nambi Here I am, 
I always set the record straight. Regardless of your position, your qualification, or your wealth, I don't care. My name is Mazo Kinna Okechukun, known as the Bia Franchise in Washington. The general. Now you see it with your Kuro Kuro eyes. I don't need to begin to get you convinced to see this. You can see it. You can feel it. In front of everybody in Vatican City, the humiliation is too much. Discrimination is too much. This is what they call white supremacy. The supremacy, they are telling you this is it. But some of our people will not understand. They are still there defending them. A Bukobi is there reading people's palm. He will see a Bukobi making his program, carry one statue, keep beside him, begin to touch him, begin to shout. Go back to Exodus 20. You will see what he said there. We can never worship idol. Those people call themselves man of dogs. Priests, pastors, imams, galamvanting, lying, and stolen from you people, mostly our poor people, stolen from them. You are sowing seed. After you sow the seed, you have to buy water to water it. After you water it, you are going to also give offering. And these people are there, deceiving you, bacchanizing your brain, telling you there is a place for you in heaven. Why these people on this planet else buying private jet worth millions of dollars and they are they are promising you that manna will fall from heaven. Now you understand what I'm talking about. Mbaka is there calling uh, the, uh, the Virgin Mary. A Bubomoso is there paying their legends to, to the Rome. But they are here now discriminating, de humiliating you people in front of the world. But up to date, you people won't learn. We have to go back to our road. There is how our ancestors were living before the colonial people came, before these missionaries came to our land. And some of our people have forgotten that this religion was imposed. They imposed it on us. They massacred our people. They killed our people. They pushed our people into submission. They pushed our people into submission to accept this madness that they brought to us. And when we are telling our people, African people will be there still defending them. I saw one man all the way from Great Britain. He came back. He came down to Africa. I think it was Congo. He, he went on his nail, crying, begging them that they should forgive them because of the atrocity and killings of our people, forcing our people in a religion that we don't even know where it is from. The man was on his nail, begging, pleading forgiveness. But our people are still there defending them. Our people, black people, are there defending something that a man came out and began to tell you, we are sorry. No, you won't listen to that one. I want this video to get to Ebu Kobi. I want this video to get to Mbaka. I want this video to get to Ebu Wemonso. All of them from A to Z. The one Anna or Oduheje. I want you to, we are going to start very soon. Any day we see any man of dog, any day we see all these idiots call themselves, they are next to God. Any day we see them again go to our dentist and begin to destroy it, we are going to deal with them. There is no two ways about it. Any day we are going to, you say that we should not talk about your own, but you are there destroying our arrows. You people are there, they destroy our ego. You people are there, Udumejana, Wari Kamuram. They will tell you they, 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 they will destroy this after these things will be going well. Anna Akiogu story. There is no infrastructure. There is no factory for you to work. There is no hospital. That is why Ike Kuremado is today ravishing in jail.
because there is no hospital and you are expecting manna to fall from heaven there is no work after finishing school you will turn to blogger because there is no job and all this man of dog they are using this opportunity to begin to deceive our people begin to destroy the minds of our people I have said it and I will keep on putting my eyes on the ground any day from today up or any day we ever see any pastor we see any priest we see any man of dog went to our deity went to our ROC to go and burn it we want to go back to our root. Biafra is our religion. And Chukwo Kikabiyama is our God. And the Biafra is the kingdom of Chukwo Kikabiyama on this planet Earth. We have claimed it. And this is the way it will be. So shall it be. He said. So shall it be. He said. So shall it be. He said. You see. I am warning those of you that don't know that we have our way of life. I am telling you people that have already accepted all this nonsensical and evil belief that they brought to you, that they are using it today to kill our people, telling you that your grandmother is doing you, telling you that your father is doing you, using jazz, using magic, to perform all these just stupid miracle they are calling miracle today like i said make sure that they will go be now coarsely that is reading people's palm that is today in lagos he can't even tell our people to go back to their land because he knows that if he try it his all those nonsense that he's doing will collapse that is why they keep on on that telling people that the things will change tomorrow make sure that this video get to happen back Make sure that they get to a Bible monster. Make sure that this video get to Father Oluwama. Now you people understand what I'm saying. I want you people to understand that we are not going to stop on this issue that we have found ourselves into. We must talk about religion. We must go back to our root. We must believe in ourselves. We don't have to depend on anybody. That is why they are seeing us as nobody today. Now I hope you understand it. And I want you to circulate this. Because we are going to come for them very hard. Any day again we see them burning our our arrows. Any day we are going to find them again burning our arrows. I greet you all. Remain blessed.